the language is off. Assalamu alaikum, Satihin. My name is Siva Osman. My pronouns are she, her, and I'm a senior. All right, people, let's do this one last time. Hey guys, how you doing? My name's Kai. I'm a sophomore here at Renton. Uh, I speak nerd, but I'm not sure that's recognized as a language. Uh, anyway, my pronouns are he, him, and I'm pretty excited to be here. Hello, Renton High. My name is Lake Gary. I'm very excited for the show today, and I'm a junior that goes to Renton. We are your MCs for today, and we welcome you to Renton High's Multi 2022. And here at Renton, we hold a yearly tradition where we showcase the fantastic amount of diversity at our school. Diversity is what makes Renton Renton. And Multi is pretty much the peak of that idea. All the different groups of our school coming together for one goal. We take pride in the many cultures that build our school, so why not show off that pride with a big show and a good time? Now, it's been a while since we've been up here. That was the last in-person multi was in January of 2020, and a lot of time has been that. Our freshman and sophomore class have not seen multi before, and we have a lot of time to make up for. But rest assured, our acts do not disappoint. So ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Brandon High's Multi 2022! Started yet, and I'm ready to be blown away. I can show you a quick preview as I get from our friends, Evo. Do tell. That's nice, Louise, but do tell what our next act is. Our first act will amaze our eyes with a traditional art performance. Fan dance is a traditional performance that is performed during the Lunar New Year and Mid Autumn Festival. They work so hard on this, so please help me walk with me. Vietnamese Student Association, as they perform their fan
Mà sao em cứ đi nhầm đường Là vào tim anh mẹ lời Làm sao chứ yêu để là thương When you call me a bitch Make me so crazy My heart can't be so her senior year milestone with her singing, as music is a big part of Filipino culture. Ladies and gentlemen, please make some noise for Alison Gumeri, as she sings Filipino songs in Tagalog.
Now, this next part of the show isn't exactly an act, but culture isn't only shown through music and dancing. The clothes you put on every day and what you wear mean a lot to your identity. So naturally, Brent and I pulls no punches as we start the first segment of our fashion show. First up, we have Maya Bellito. Maya is representing the Ethiopian culture and the Hyger culture. Maya is wearing a Habesha kameez, or known as a Hyger lips. It's a colorful, traditional dress. It's worn to formal events, church, and parties. Next up, we have Amira Munoz. Amira is wearing the Samput, which is a culturally significant garment of Cambodia. It is worn by both men and women as a form of sarong. The sarong coat is paired with a karma, which is a scarf. The scarf is not just an item of apparel, it is an iconic symbol of the Cambodian nation. Next, we have Brittany Nguyen wearing an Ao Yai. This dress, traditionally worn during Lunar New Year, represents national spirit, a sense of persevering, and development of proud, traditional values. Let's hear one more time for Maya, Brittany, and Amira. Now hats off to our next act. Our Vietnamese Student Association has prepared another performance for us today. This unique dance is done with headwear and is a way for um, students here to express, it's a way to express creativity and tie it back to Renton. Now, please make some noise for VSA's Hat Dance!
Hispanic, this group incorporates different styles of dance from different regions of Mexico. Their performance is an exciting twist of cumbia, zapateado, traditional payaso de rodeo, merengue, and reggaeton dance styles. So make some noise for Mix Hispanic! usually done during Lunar New Year and other festivals. It symbolizes wealth and brings honors to one's family. Please give a warm welcome to Asian Student Union as they perform their Umbrella Day!
As the first of FSU's performances, Cotillion showcases a young lady's transition from a girl into womanhood in Filipino culture. Please give a warm welcome for F. which is a very popular folk dance in the Philippines. It is said to have originated from their seventh largest island, Mindoro. Let's watch Candle Dance Light on the
Here we have the next set of our fashion show. Let's give a round of applause for Himo Austin! <laughs> Himo is wearing an abaya. The abaya is universal worn in Muslim countries. Abaya is usually worn to religious celebrations. It is a symbol of modesty in Islam and it comes with multiple different designs. Henna is also an important part of Islamic culture. It is worn by women on their hands, feet, arms, and necks during weddings, Eid, Ramadan, and other festive occasions. Next, we have Nelly Musiwal representing the Republic of DRC Congo. <laughs> Nelly is wearing the panier, which is French for the wrapper. Traditionally worn during festivals and other celebrations. This cloth is wrapped around the waist and rolled over to form a skirt, as you can see here. It is a symbol of wealth, birth, and marriage. Le panier can also be a form of artistic expression. Please give it up one more time for Hebo and Nelly. Hey Hebo, look what K-pop taught us. So what do you think? Yeah, I don't know about that one, guys. Let's see the professionals do it. Welcome on stage, K-pop
the solo performer, singing Buwan by Juan Carlos. Buwan actually means moon in Tagalog. Ladies and gentlemen, please make some noise for Cristina Del Mundo! This next act is a multi-classic. From the music choice and the engaging performance, there's nothing not to love. Ephesus Tinikling is a folklore dance in the Philippines. It involves people dancing and jumping while the bamboo sticks get clapped. It originated from Filipino farmers catching and preventing tickling birds from stealing their crops. If you didn't know what Tinikling was before, I promise you, you'll remember. Please get loud for FSU!
Here for our last fashion show segment, we have Andrea Arias wearing a Mexican outfit. Her shawl, which is traditionally used for dance, is embroidered with the image of La Guadalupe, the Virgin Mary, who holds massive cultural and religious significance. which are made of pure gold, specific to the state of Jalisco, though each Mexican state has its own signature time and time. All of and But Andrea isn't the only person we have here today. Please get loud for Chorus Posada representing Thailand. <laughs> Wearing a traditional sabai and skirt, this particular style comes from the kingdom of Ayutthaya. This traditional Thai garment is worn during formal events like weddings. Ladies and gentlemen, please start clapping again for Andrea and Cora! Next up, we have our Student Union performing their fan dance. You know, fan dance has a lot of cultural significance. So true, guy. Traditions we form at festivals and fairs like Lunar New Year, the fans actually have, represent flowers along with longevity and luck. So true, Langston. Please give a hand to Fan Dance!
going to showcase how unique black culture is. Full of influence, full of influence from African dance and poetry style chants, there's a lot of heart and culture to take pride of here. I know I'm ready to see my sisters do their thing and own the stage. And how can you not be excited for BSU in February?
performances from all walks of life. K-pop to fan dance. From tinickling to mixed Hispanic. To BSU to VSA. And so many more. Multi is truly a time where we can come together and celebrate the differences that strengthen us as individuals and as a community. And I'm so glad us seniors were able to pass the torch to our underclassmen. And through all this craziness, this year's multi felt like a return home. To see our peers take to the stage and perform shows that they choreographed, practiced, and put so much effort into, it's irreplaceable. This show makes me proud of Renton High, of our diversity, and our willingness to celebrate it. And even though multi happens every year, I think I can speak for everyone and say it's a once in a lifetime experience every time. So thank you again for joining us for Multi 2022! Okay, thank you so much.